Okay, we're gonna answer the question about cream soups and specifically how to make cream of broccoli soup. Uh, this certainly would be one of America's favorite soups, the cream of broccoli, and um, we're gonna put a little twist or two on this, but I'm gonna give you a formula and a process, some techniques and principles about making cream of broccoli soup that you can apply to just about all the cream soups that you make if you want to, okay? Obviously, there's multiple ways of making cream soup. Um, I think the overall, we have to say that people would assume that a cream soup is a soup that's creamy and has been slightly thickened. That's how one would identify one, I suppose. Um, but in the um, big picture, there's a few principles and techniques that are very specific that can guide and help you through the process of making any cream soup. And you're gonna learn those on this video today. Um, we also have two other cream soups, and you will notice that the techniques and uh, process that I take uh, the cream of broccoli soup, soup through will more or less be duplicated with different little twists and turns on the cream of potato soup and the cream of tomato soup that are both part of this text, okay? So we're gonna start you out with the cream of broccoli and we're gonna begin by um, putting a little bit of whole unsalted butter into a soup pan, okay? And we have a little gallon and a half pan here. And we're going to put a little bit of butter in there. And I want you to pay special attention to how I cut the broccoli up because the part of the broccoli that you're going to use for the soup is just the center part of this root. The bottom part of this root, which is slightly woody, is always discarded. It has no function in cooking or eating to speak of. So 